Welcome back to our channel and thank you so much for joining us in this another episode of Living on the Artistic Edge. Today, we will be sharing with you some speech therapy tips on how we navigate through our journey right here on the Artistic Edge. Now, one of the first stages in our speech therapy is to help the child to make sounds, an appropriate sound. To start our speech therapy sessions, normally we do some warm-up oral exercise. Now, how did I came up with this one? I have a few friends who are in need. What I have discovered that each time they are preparing for a presentation, they normally do some oral exercise. No, I, I was a little bit shocked in one of the conversations to hear that they do oral exercise. So I am like, oral exercise? I thought oral exercise was just for people who have speech deficiency and all of that. Practicing oral exercise actually strengthen the oral muscles in your face. Here. The oral muscles are the muscles that we use for speech. So in pronouncing every letter of the alphabet, there are particular ways in which to position your lip, your tongue, your mouth in order to come up with certain sounds from the letters. So for example, if you're gonna do the letter B, of course, you saw where my, my lip went in. B, I use different oral muscles to form the sound of the letter B. Because you'll have to put, once you say B, you'll have to put some strength on the lip for the B. Now, if you're gonna do A, and the letter A is pronounced A. So, for A, you may want to open your mouth, and that sound may be coming more from the back of your throat, so it's A. Ah, the oral motor exercise actually helps to strengthen the different muscles that is used for pronouncing letters or making sounds, all right? So we use a little lubricant to do some facial exercise. Now, there is nothing special in the lubricant because what I tend to do is I use lotion. I use his lotion to just put a little bit on my hands to kind of massage the cheek. There is no magic in the lotion. It's just used as a lubricant and it is safer for his face. I am gonna show you an example of how we do our oral motor warm up before we actually start our speech therapy session. And this oral motor warm up exercise will also be coming with the sound ah. So you listen out for that. Thank you. This is lotion. This is lotion. All right, now you're gonna rub your cheek with the lotion. Rub mommy cheek, rub mommy cheek. Rub mommy cheek. Yeah, so mommy's gonna rub your cheek. All right, so rub your cheek. Come, come. Rub your cheek. Rub your Cheek, rub your cheek. All right, come up a little closer. So mommy gonna massage the cheek. All right, go. I'm gonna pull this back a little. Turn to the camera. Pull this back a little. Nice. You feel that? Open. Ah. 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 All right. You like it? Do you like it? Do you like it? Yeah. Really? Alright. Mm. 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 Alright. You gonna do mommy balloon? Give mommy a rub, please. Give mommy a rub. Rub mommy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That one. <laughs> I love you. are gonna work on some oral now, alright? Okay? Okay. Okay. Open. Alright? Open wide. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Ah, 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 very good. All right, 
can you open and hold for five? So look at mommy, you're gonna do this. Ah. 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 No, no, no. You're just gonna go open. Ah. 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 Very good. Let's try that again. So we want to feel the cheek. Yes, the cheek. You feel the cheek? You feel it here? Do you feel it here? Yeah, mommy. All right, so let's open wide again. Ready? 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 Mommy. Come on. Ah. 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 No, you're going to open and hold. Ready? Open and hold. Here we go. Ah. ah. No, ah. open. Do this. Ah. 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 Look at me. Ah. 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 Ah, ah, ah. I like it, I like it. <laughs> All right, so if you're not holding, you're doing it for five. Can we do one more? Five. That, yeah, that was 10. So can we do one more? Ready? Ready. Let's go. Open. Ah. 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 Nice. That was ah. ah. And you're getting out the sound. That is beautiful. I like it. That is it. Ah, so let's see her open wide and do the ah, all right? I'm not going to count. I'm not going to come open wide and do the ah. We're just going to do some cheek stretches. Come on. Ah. Yeah. Yeah, good. Open. Ah. 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 Oh, can you give me a song? Ah. ah. Get down the hand. Ah, come on. Ah. 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 ah, you want to feel the stretch in your cheek. So we're gonna do that five more times. Here we go. Ah, ah. close. Ah. 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 One more time. Ah. ah. All right. So that's so much for the cheek stretches. We're not going to do anything more tonight. All right. That's okay? Okay. You did very well. Nice. That was indeed a good warm-up exercise. And you can put your own twist to it. And depending on your child. Remember, let me just say this to you. You are not going to get it at the first time you try. I have had multiple failures before I get to this stage with Alex. So just keep trying, keep practicing. You can do this at home, um, in your car, wherever is comfortable. Um, you can sitting in your settee just by talking to him. You're just having your fun time and you do that little moral exercise. And remember, the name is therapy. Now, when you talk about speech, therapy and therapy means repetition so keep practicing practicing whenever i'm introducing an activity for alex Xavier, like for example speech normally i do the same activities for at least a week no less at least a week we do the same thing over and over for at least a week before we try something new and sometimes by week two, you'll find that he might be making some effort in doing it and may not get it perfect. So you may want to practice it a little more until you can get the sound out. Once again, thank you so much for joining us in this another episode of Living on the Autistic Edge. Now, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe.